What is good guys? Today's vlog is gonna be super chill. Got a lot of errands and things to run as well as finally getting a haircut, so no product in my hair today. Uh, this thing's just been getting out of hand and I've been putting it off because, I don't know, ain't nobody got time to sit in a chair for an hour. Uh, at least that's what I think. So I'm at Starbucks, I'm gonna do a whole bunch of uh, Ataku Garage accounting work, plus, Got my new Japanese book here, Japanese for Busy People. I'm really enjoying this, actually. My mother-in-law got this for me. Um, I, I, I think it was kind of a jab, like, hurry up and learn Japanese, <laughs> you lazy prick. No. <laughs> um, but no, in all seriousness, uh, going into Starbucks, gonna do some study, get a good coffee, and then, uh, I don't know, we'll pick it up from there, I guess. Okay, so I might have a coffee problem, um, but at least I'm ready to jump into the study session. Let's go. On my way now to the hairdressers, I'm pretty keen to uh, introduce you guys to my hairdresser actually because his name is Momo, as in like the Momo steering wheel. He's a pretty rad guy, he spent a bit of time in Australia too, so his English is kind of like, mm, okay. Um, that's the most important thing while you live here in Japan is trying to find a hairdresser that you can communicate with, otherwise, uh, yeah, you could end up looking really weird. This guy here is Momo, everyone. He's a rad dude for being named after a steering wheel or a peach, I'm not sure. Oh, Momo, Momo san. What? Another name is Momo Momo Peach or Kuruma Steering Wheel Handle. Which one? It's completely different. Handle, handle. Okay. He'd prefer to be named after the uh, the steering wheel than the peach, that's for sure. But uh, as you can see, he uh, mixed some pink and purple together and made my hair do this. So. We'll see what it's going to turn out later when we put some product in it, but I'm loving it. Check this thing out, man. Like, Momo is some kind of magician. Hey, like, this thing looks crazy. Also looks super Japanese and Asian. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. Thanks, mate. You're a champion. Arigato. Arigato. <laughs> there is nothing more fresh than a fresh haircut. And man, do I love Momo. He's such a rad guy. All right, we gotta work out this parking thing. Here we go. Button. So it's always generally the number that your car's parked in. So see, there's a number eight in front of my car and then you just push this top right hand corner button and that'll uh, do it. So I gotta pay 600 yen because I was here for a little bit longer than usual and then uh, it'll lift the thing up and we can go. So now that I've paid the parking, there you go, it just went down. By the way, you do not ever want to forget about this because you will F your car up so bad, like so, 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 so bad. It's not even, not even funny. All right, let's go for a ride and uh, figure out what we're doing for the rest of the day. Probably a live stream, honestly. So it's the next day now, and I'm on my way to Yashio factory to finish getting all the stickers off the car. I figured this would be a good segue into yesterday's vlog because I want to make an entirely different video for the reveal one. And I'm going to actually put the reveal video out uh, first and then this after. So if you guys are kind of, like the timeline's definitely going to be a little bit messed up. Um, but I'm sure you guys will understand. Anyway, so yeah, we're heading to Yashio, we're gonna get the car finished, and uh, the best thing is, is Amazon came through and delivered Quick Smart for me, which is brilliant, because uh, I actually only ordered one of these little uh, caramel wheels, um, but they accidentally sent me a five pack, which is like a hundred dollar pack. So, um, I mean, I ain't complaining. Um, I don't know if maybe I read the listing wrong in Japanese, but I was pretty certain that there was a five pack that was a hundred dollars and a single pack that was, you know, like twenty dollars and I only bought the single pack. Um, so thanks Amazon, really appreciate that. And then I also got uh, this kind of like Goo Gone kind of spray stuff. So uh, we're, we're planning to get everything done on the S15 today so I can do the reveal video. That's all that I really care about is because I just want to show you guys the entire car so uh, yeah, we'll go from there. Let's get to Yashio. <laughs> Can't wait to get her all fixed up. It's gonna look like a million bucks. Oh, I love this thing so much. Oh man, the turbo sounds so good. <laughs> all right, let's get to Yashio and go. Okay, so it's been a few hours now and I've been using the, uh, the caramel wheel here and I've gotten so much off the car, so much faster. Uh, for instance, this sticker I can show you because this is a Yashio factory one. Um, this particular one, it was made with like this really weird kind of thin reflective vinyl that's super thin and the moment the sun hits it, it goes all brittle. I've hit that with a caramel wheel on all these places here. This was all covered and it's all gone like really fast and quick. So definitely getting the job done way quicker now that I got a caramel wheel. Um, and these things are just amazing. And this is the first one, like I haven't even gone to a second one yet and I've still got like, I don't know, three quarters of the way left, like a quarter left of the wheel. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna keep working on it and going from there, 
but I'm so happy with how it's all turning out. Then all we gotta do is go through with the special goo off spray and a rag and try and clean off as much as the stuff and then we'll be able to do the full reveal of the car. I'm so pumped. So I've now finished with this entire side and uh, the only downside to obviously using caramel wheels is the mess that it makes. So I've been trying to like vacuum everything but I need to obviously like vacuum up the pavement and stuff here as well because it's just everywhere and it's super windy today so it's getting blown around and whatnot. But uh, I'm super pumped because it looks like at this current pace I'm going to have enough time to do a reveal video. Uh, which you guys will see first before this one but you know what I mean, I'm just really excited. So all I've got left to do now is clean off all this glue. And I did buy like the special goo off stuff but unfortunately I've run out of it really really quick. Um, but luckily I got like a layer of it on everything so it is coming off pretty easy. And what I'm doing is I'm just hitting it with a bit of brake cleaner as well. And then once the brake cleaner kind of soaks in, it comes off really easy. So once I've gone and done this with all the big stuff, then I'm gonna give the car like a quick wash with a soapy bucket and a sponge. And then I'll uh, do the re shoot the reveal video. I'm really keen cause like, man, I've been working on this all day, hey. It's been a struggle, but it, it's so worth it. You know what I mean? When you put your own work, blood, sweat and tears into something, it's so much more rewarding. Yeah. I'm loving doing this actually. It's kind of like tedious, but it's also very relaxing if you know what I mean. <laughs> Look at that, just comes straight off after the brake cleaner soaks in for a while. Pretty decent. All right, I'm gonna keep going, get this thing done because we're starting to run out of light and I wanna have some decent light for when I uh, do the reveal. So let's go. So I've pushed it back here and uh, I'm gonna give it a really good bath and a wash now. Um, don't worry, I'm not planning to keep these wheels. I'll probably sell these like really quickly and the whole body kit's going, but man, I'm way too excited time to give this thing a bath it's first bath with me and uh yeah there's still like a lot of little things like little parts of stickers and stuff stuck on here but i can go over that a lot more in detail later on and give it like a proper detail although i don't really care about this paint because it's getting completely painted a different color this whole body kit's coming off so yeah but nonetheless let's get it clean and looking good for the uh for the reveal just finished giving her a bath and the paint actually came out pretty good after i like cleaned it and scrubbed it it looks pretty decent i i just noticed these kind of like underglowish lights i don't know it's kind of cool but uh we're just letting it warm up and we're going to try and move it inside so i can film the review in here with some lighting and stuff i'd be sick to kind of get the yashio cars in the background as well but uh i'm really pumped man i can't wait just moved the car inside so i'm now going to set up and do the reveal video I'm way too excited. I wonder if Okachan will let me do a foot on in the garage. It's not like he doesn't do them himself. <laughs> um, but yeah, anyways, um, I'm way too excited that I could finally show this to you guys and film the video. So I'm gonna do that now and then I will pick up where we left off. So finished the reveal video and all things considered, I think it turned out really good. Um, although we were really crunched for time and I was rushing because we were meant to leave the workshop at seven to meet up with Okachan's wife for dinner and we're just leaving now and it's 7.53. So kind of, oh. Um, but anyways, after dinner, we'll catch up then. Uh, I'm currently following Okachan and his baller S15, which is kind of cool. Um, but yeah, anyways, dinner after that, Let's catch up. Okay, so I'm home, I'm out of the shower. I am so ready to pass out and go to bed, but I need to finish editing. Uh, it's nearly like 1 a.m. and I have to be up early tomorrow as well. So it's, th this is hurting me. <laughs> um, but yeah, today, um, man, like, well, this vlog was kind of like two days kind of mashed together. And I definitely after editing it uh, a fair bit, I realized that it is kind of like all over the shop. And the main reason for that is just that um, I was super focused on getting the stickers done so that I could reveal the video to you as soon as possible. Um, and that then meant that I, get, like, I wasn't in like the mindset of how I normally am with vlogging. Um, so I do apologize for that, but still I hope you guys enjoyed kind of seeing behind the scenes and how I got the car ready so that I could do that reveal video for you guys. Um, yeah, I'm so pumped for S15 content. Tell me in the comment section if you are too. Also guys, good moment to pub uh to plug my live streaming channel this is my rig this is uh what you guys see and uh i'm filming actually with my streaming software right now um but yeah if you guys uh want to check out my live streams definitely hit the link in the description check out the summit live youtube channel or twitch and then you can uh subscribe and turn the alerts on as well anyways i think that kind of wraps everything up i actually really enjoyed myself i think with this video like in the two days and being able to show you like you know even just like introducing momo to you guys like i thought that was kind of cool because yeah i've been wanting to introduce momo to you guys for ages so yeah i think that's it catch you in the next one guys don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one